The Abilene Police Department reported a high number of vehicle crashes so far this year. Our Adriana Alexander spoke to the Department of Transportation on what may be some of the causes. The Abilene Police Department reported an influx of car crashes happening this year, but the Texas Department of Transportation does have a few theories as to why these car crashes are happening. APD shared a map showing where fatal car crashes have happened so far this year. The highest recorded number of fatalities in a year was 21. We're in June and are currently at 13 fatal crashes with 17 fatalities. So we started to see a trend on increasing uh, fatalities back when the pandemic first occurred. Um, so about in 2020. The National Safety Council reports the lifetime odds of an American dying in a car wreck are roughly 1 in 107. That means that every person in the country with a driver's license and a functional vehicle has about a 0.91% chance of ending up as a victim of a driving related crash. Driving defensively, avoiding distracted driving and slowing down are some of the many suggestions for drivers on the road. Uh, folks need to remember that they need to uh, allow themselves that extra time to reach their destination, uh, to slow down, take their time, and then be courteous, share the road, and drive defensively. So don't wait until you get up on the construction zone to get in the, uh, the other lane. We give fair warning that that construction's coming up. Make sure you merge early, and then also make sure that, again, you know, that you're not on the phone or anything, you know, being distracted while you're driving. It is advised to follow those tips as well as the additional tips on our website at foxwtx.com. The goal is to avoid any more car crashes from happening in Abilene and West Texas. Adriana Alexander, Fox West Texas.